happy friday so this is my outfit we're about to go to breakfast me alex and ivy it's his birthday toy birch sandals i'm gonna do my kate spade purse today because i don't want to do a baby bag so i'm gonna do this tote well hobo bag i think it's called <laughs> wearing like a little navy blue tank i'm wearing the necklaces that i got last week from Vasona and the layers ivy it layers so cute so i have the m can y'all see it I have the M like in the last hole to make it like longest. And then I have the cross necklace in the, like what? The closest to the end hole. So it's layered in this cute little like dainty way. I'm wearing the little Amazon dupe earrings. I think I'm gonna change my watch band to the blue. But yeah, I have the headband in from Amazon, this scrunchie. Is as well it's like a satin scrunchie from amazon i really like these scrunchies because like they don't pull out my hair so i wish this was like not as cream and was white so like i think i'm gonna look into like ordering like a satin white headband but i also have like this champagne colored like forever mood headband that i might switch this for let's try it there's a baby in here with me so this is the Fever Mood like champagne color, like nude color headband. Which one do y'all like? Because neither one matches. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna keep it in the Fever Mood because it just has like that satin elevated luxury look. So with my edges looking a mess. And my combo today is the Disco Daydreams. Let me close this hamper that is like busting open. I need to do my laundry. I love that you could just hide the laundry. I got this from Ross. It's such a cute hamper. I think it was like $14.99. But anywho, I'm wearing the Disco Daydreams, um, Sugar Sky, and Skylar Delight, Boardwalk Delight by Skylar. Um, I just talked about this trio on my video yesterday. So if y'all haven't watched my current body care layering, um, video, then check it out. And just because I want a little extra something, something, I'm going to use this little sample of Vose Viva by Valentino. Just a little spritz like here. Yeah. And here. It's kind of fresh smelling, so I'm feeling fresh today. Um, so yeah, we're about to go to breakfast, and I will see you guys later. Because we have to go get Alex's gift and pick up some things for the people that's coming over tonight. How cute are these little heels? I call them heels for Ivy. Ivy, you need to drink your bottle because we're about to go. And now I want to bring it. I wanted to look up the notes in that Valentino fragrance because it smells so good to me. It smells like, I don't know, like kind of vanilla, sweet. It's like sweet and fresh. I gotta know. There you are. Will this get copyrighted? Because I might have to pick this up. Okay, found it. It's a citrus white floral vanilla sweet scent. Let's see. I knew it was vanilla. Okay, top notes are mandarin, orange, bergamot, and ginger. So kind of, mm -hmm, okay. It's mixing with that um, cotton candy delight. So it can only, it's not, I don't know what it truly smells like. Um, middle notes are orange blossom, gardenia. Base notes are vanilla, tonka bean musk, sandalwood, and oak moss. I get the moss and the vanilla while it's mixed with the um let me put this where i can see it so i don't forget but yeah i'm taking the kate spade i forget what the name of this one is the style um but yeah so y'all know all my stuff fits in the no you got all that stuff in the bed to play with <laughs> 
Y'all know all my stuff basically fits in this Vera Bradley like little tote thing. So it's really good for when you're in sport mode. Sport mode to me is when you're like sharing your purse with your baby and you're not taking any kind of book bag or baby bag. This is like sport mode, but like a different sport mode. I don't know, just a little Like I am in sport sport mode because this is all I wanna bring. So I have some wipes in here. I have three diapers, even though Ivy doesn't really go that much. This is a game changer. This is like a formula um, feeder thing. And it has like, I don't know if y'all can see, like three different sections. And you put the little nozzle on each section and you can just dump it in the bottle. So I'm just going to slide the bottle on the side and put this in the side too. And then we need... I don't grab the camera. Can you play? Last weekend. Oh no, she with the ladybug one. But this one has blue in it too. It has like a little dragonfly on it and it's pink. So, and she has a pink bow in. I mean a blue bow in. And I'm gonna just put this in the side pocket. And zip it. And everything fits perfectly. And I still have all my essentials. I have her essentials. Um. I could do like a little baggie of puffs, which I think I might, and then that's it. But this is how everything looks in the bag. Okay. Oh, and I keep um, a changing pad in my car that where I could just change her, just grab it and go into wherever I am, or um, just change her on the tailgate at the car. And I also keep a jug of water in my car as well but as you see the bottle the bottle i'm bringing is already pre-filled to that so what did i say i was gonna do oh i'm gonna go get her some puffs in a bag and so i'm wearing the pink punch Two Face uh, Lip Injection Extreme Lip Plumper. And like, it has like no color to me. Like, what do y'all think? Like, it looks hot pink in the tube, but I'm not getting hot pink tint on my lips. And I kind of regret not getting strawberry juice, I'm not gonna lie. So I can't wait to run out of that because this is by Replay. So it looks like this. Look, it's got a little. Uh, this so at the bottom we're gonna put her little crunchies i got her little mouth shadow in this one um of strawberry and like sweet potato she loves these so i'm actually gonna add some more the strawberry apple crumb oh my gosh y'all she loves also i'm not bringing this because it's cold and it's refrigerated so i want to show y'all these things she likes she loves these little danimal yogurts in the pouch She loves this, the strawberry and banana. Um, yeah. Okay, so I got her some snacks, and I think that's all I'm gonna bring. There's a blanket in the car, and it's hot as I don't know what out there. And that's it. I love my little necklace. She's like so cute. But yeah, let's go. Hello, so Ivy ditched me. She's with her dad. <laughs> I'm thinking about helping have like a girl's day. She was like, baby, I skipped my morning nap, so good night. She take a nap. Alex is at home, clearly with her. So I am at Starbucks because the new fall drinks are out. So I'm about to get a, I've been practicing. I'm about to get a grande iced pumpkin cream chai tea latte. 
And I'm gonna see if they have brown sugar syrup because I want like two pumps of brown sugar syrup. And we're gonna taste it because I've never had this one before, but like that pumpkin cream just sounds so good. <sighs> then we're going to the mall. I wanna find Alex a gift. I wanna buy him like a bracelet, like a nice men's bracelet. I'm gonna see what I can find at the mall. Also gonna run by Bath and Body Works, of course, because they're having the candles, $13.95 sale. So I'm gonna get a couple candles because for a member's appreciation, they gave us like a $10 off. And of course they sent me more coupons. So I'm gonna get my free travel size item. And I think I have a $6 wallflower plug with the refill. Um, so I'm gonna pick that up. And I also need to use a reward because i have an app reward that's expiring i think on september 4th and i don't think i'm coming back to bath and body works until the labor day sale they're having like a try to believe it um labor day sale so i think everything's gonna be like 5.95 so that's what i'm doing and then after that i'm gonna go to marshall's to see if i can find him a nice men's fragrance um Oh, I think I'm gonna go. So y'all know how Alex said he was gonna buy me the Ariana Grande Cloud Pink. I have $30 in Ulta Rewards now. So that will drive the price down to $38. So I'm gonna buy that myself. <laughs> and I'm going to go get, if I like it, I'm gonna go to the mall and smell it. The new Coco um, Soray Tease Flanker. From Victoria's Secret oh my god it looks so good and right now they're running a bundle where you get um you can get the small one with a lotion and the cute little like fall puffer bag like clutch um for I think 75 or you can get the 3.4 ounce a lotion and a spray and the bag for like 95 so if I can get that if I like it I'm gonna get the 3.4 and I'm gonna see if they'll let me mix and match what lotion and um mist i can get because i want to get a different scent i don't want it all to be the coco soray because i want that to go with my autumn shore body care that i have so that's gonna be so cute especially when i take it to the mountains ah i'm so excited so yeah we're gonna go smell that as well basically we're about to be at the mall y'all know every weekend I'm running my butt to the mall but yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'll see you guys maybe in the mall if I'm up for vlogging. We'll see. The drink is secured. I didn't get the brown sugar syrup because I just want to see if I like it regular without all the sugar. Like, I got to stop with all the sugar, y'all. The pumpkin cream looks good. Mm. I don't know what pumpkin tastes like. I got this bracelet um i'll show y'all everything when i get home i also did the perfume bundle so i'll show y'all everything i'm just about to put everything in the back and then i also went to bath and body works and did the candle sale i just picked up a few scents i went to starbucks and got a pink drink again and now i'm about to go into marshall's to see if i can find him a fragrance and i don't know some other little knickknacks Guys, look at these cute freaking Reeboks. What size are these? I think I need these. They're thirty nine ninety nine. They just need to get wiped down with the neutral bottom and a platform. I just cleaned um, Alex's sink. I want to show y'all all his little sets that he loves. And I forgot to show y'all what he uses. Um, what I found at Marshalls for him for his birthday. I got this Nivea Men Fresh Ocean uh, spray deodorant. And then I found the Guest Seductive, which is his favorite um, cologne. See how much he uses? He loves this cologne. Um, I have to replace this one every year for Christmas because he goes through it. But I found the body spray for him to use um, with it, I guess, to make it like more long lasting. I don't know, just for him to layer with it. And I also bought him a corksicle cup 
He loved all of it. The cork's so good. Roll Tide, baby. And he has like a bigger cup that has like game day on it with a bunch of footballs that's white. And I thought that when he's double cupping, um, that would be a cute little combo for him since it's football season. And then I found this for me basically, but it's for him. <laughs> this is a personal grooming portable vacuum. So he can just kind of like sweep up like when he shaves. Cause y'all know he's, bald. well, I don't know if y'all know, but he's bald and like when he shaves his head and like does his maintenance, it gets hair everywhere. So that um that is what I got him in addition to his nice bracelet that I got from Reeds. Isn't it pretty? I got something, this is genuine leather, um, and it's got silver interwoven in there. I got him something for every day because Alex is not a flashy. Let me get ready and talk. <sighs> Y'all seen this dress a million times. It's that $5.99 dress I got from Ross. Oh, my mom gave me a dress from Ross yesterday. I got him. Mm -hmm. But how cute is this? Can y'all see it? It's like blue and ruffly. It's got sweet rain. She got it for $16.99. And it's like super cute. Um, and like, I might wait to church. I don't know. Oh yeah, my soap is empty. I emptied the cactus blossom soap. I'm gonna put it in my empties for, you know, three months from now, but I bought these two, these four soaps. I was thinking that these two could be mine, which is the white coconut and caramel and coffee and whiskey. And then since it's kind of masculine looking, the sweet whiskey for Alex and then the warm cedar and amber, this smells really good. But I'm trying to figure out if I like Sweet whiskey, more, or coffee and whiskey. I like coffee and whiskey, so. I'm gonna put coffee and whiskey up here on my sink. And Alex doesn't need soap right now, but I'm just gonna put these down here for the bathroom. And I left the ones in the kitchen and for the guest bathroom in the kitchen. So, I've been using this I don't know if y'all remember me for prime day i ordered the rio dio by sol de janeiro um i like it but i don't know if it's this heat but like it doesn't hold me as long as i need it to i'm not absolutely musty i wouldn't say like oh she's flat out musty but like i can start to smell a scent so i feel like if i can smell it you can smell it and i don't like that so um i usually pretty much wear this one like in the house my tried and true dove never fails me but i'm gonna try something today i'm gonna double deodorize so i went in with the rio deo and then on top i sprayed the spray deodorant the dove pear and aloe vera scent i'm almost out of this too um this one's not aluminum free but it's alcohol free and it's not directly on my skin so i don't know i hope it works and then I'm about to go in with my Summer's Eve um, daily freshening spray. I'm probably going to cut this out. And if I don't, we're not besties. <laughs> okay. And then I'm going to do the Fresh Coconut and Cotton Body Lotion. I'm just going to go. They do this thing down here every year, like a vintage market on the square. So, um, we go every year. I'm, <laughs> I'm pretty tired from the party last night. Everything went very well, but I'm just, I'm going to support my mom because she really wants to go. But I ain't got nothing for you. Unless it's two dollars. <coughs> I went in with the first coconut and cotton vice right now. I'm about to spray a little bit of the cocoa paradise because it's not my favorite. And then the Ariana Grande cloud. If you want to see my other, oh, the baby scratched me. And like every time I spray, my God, it hurts. It stings. 
if you want to see my body layering um, combos, I just posted it on Thursday. And for the face, I'm just doing like um, bare face. I'm wearing skin today. Because I don't want to have to wash my face when I get home easily. I should have did my skincare before I put on that body lotion. Because now I'm basically putting body lotion on my face. But here we are. And then I'm going to use the Kapari face cream. Y'all, I should not have went to Starbucks because now my regular iced coffees aren't good enough for me. It's like, oh, I gotta have, I gotta have a iced pumpkin chai tea latte. And I think I'm gonna stop and get one because I deserve it. And I'll probably get the kids like a cookie or something. I hope they have some bacon glue sandwiches. Those are my favorite. The kids already had, uh, you know, they're going to eat. They're going to eat. They had some cereal and some yogurt, so they're not starving. Did I talk to y'all about this lip injection? Don't you feel like my lips, like, look at the tube. And y'all know the strawberry kiss was, like, this dark, too. Shouldn't my lips have more of a tint? But I love this. This is so good. It's my favorite lip gloss. It's not lip gloss, but... I usually go out the house in the plumper and then reapply the summer Fridays uh, lip balm. I think I'm gonna go silver today. My, my gold little stack was so cute. I put it on Instagram. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep it simple. Do I even want a necklace? Yeah, I haven't worn my silver necklace in a while, so I'm gonna wear it. Y'all, we got some stuff to open up. I gotta show y'all so much that I bought yesterday. This necklace always has hair in it, though. My hair. <sighs> but yeah, I gotta show y'all everything I bought. How do I look? Cute. I love this one. This has like all my little charms that Alex and my mom and everybody sentimental got me. <sighs> and I'm wearing flip flops, y'all. The white ones. today like the shiny gold since everything's so simple maybe I could just be shiny on the feet I've had these for years look at that um so boutique and I kind of like I know they're dirty but like bear with me I like that they're that it's padded like they're supportive so my feet need some love oh I gotta put my shorts on I mean, we just talk about this. Okay, now I am ready. Let's go to Starbucks. They do this vintage market on the square down here every year. My mom wanted to go today, so so I wasn't gonna buy anything, but I bought this pumpkin. 
How pretty is she? She was unique. That's why I got her. And she was only $28. Y'all know I love to read. I love books. This is made out of paper pages, like books. How cute is that? And her shop is called Paper Doll Handmade. I should have a montage of things, like other things that she had. She had this cute like little mice, this little like mouse type thing. She had like flowers. It was just really, really cool. So I did get this one. I just thought it was so nice and well made. This feels like real trees, so I don't know. And I just thought it was really cute. I'm gonna put this on my fireplace. Trust me, it's not in any danger because I do not use my fireplace until winter just about because fall is non-existent here in the South. I also picked up something for myself from Reeds when I went and got Alex's bracelet. I went ahead because I did look online to at the cross charms. I wanted a cross charm for my bracelet. So I went ahead and got it from there. I hope y'all, I hope it's focusing on this and not me. There we go. So I got that and then I did a Sephora order and I did, these are my samples. I did the Skylar Peach Fields and the YSL. I think this is a man fragrance. I have two, I have two fragrances from Sky, Skylar. Um, Vanilla Sky and Boardwalk Delight. They're all travel size though. It's not full size. I also picked up an Anastasia Clear Brow Gel, the little mini size. And the Rare Beauty Lip Oil in the shade Hope. Let me tell you the exact name. Soft Pinch Tinted Lip Oil in the shade Hope. And I did put a light layer on my lips. And it does have like a minty type feel, but I'm not, I don't know, actually, now that I think about it. It might be from the Laneige. I had the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask on as well. Okay, now I can't get this back out. It's crazy. But yeah, it looks like this, like the pink shade. That's what I got. So yeah. And then I also got the new Rio. So de Janeiro. Um, Rio. Oh no, it's not called Rio anything. After Hours. And this one has Midnight Jasmine and Amber Woods. And let's see. I want this to smell like. I did shower again when I got home and I used the fresh coconut and cotton. So I feel like nothing will clash with that too bad. Mm. Oh my gosh, y'all. This smells just like Victoria's Secret Fairies perfume. I want to go get it. I'll be right back. And I bought my tablet so we can get on for granted color because y'all know how I like to look at the notes and stuff. But like straight off rip, it smells like me, to me the Fearless by Victoria's Secret. But we're gonna look it up because what? What is this called? They probably don't even have the notes yet after hours. Oh, it's on here. So De Janeiro. If y'all are interested in like what I like to look it up, this is how the site looks. I don't know if y'all can see. It's the friend Grantica site. It's like an encyclopedia for like a bunch of stuff. Black current. Black current are the okay, top notes for after hours. Black current pair. Middle notes are night blooming jasmine, vanilla, whipped cream, and freesia. The base notes are Caramel, patchouli, and amberwood. I don't like patchouli. I don't get any patchouli on me. On my skin, first spray, it's a sweet, creamy, like vanilla, a floral vanilla. I don't know if that's that freesia. Freesia sometimes gives me a headache. But um, freesia and vanilla, like it does have that floral note. Okay, let's look up Fearless and then I'm gonna spray because I'm telling y'all, this smells just like the Fearless Fragrance by Victoria's Secret. I think I'm about to make a shorts. They're not the same, like the same main accord. It, the only main accord that is similar is Fruity, but they say that the Fearless is Iris Fruity Powdery. Let me look at these notes. So I know I'm not crazy. 
really simple notes for this one black currant iris and orris root it's probably the black currant that's making me feel i mean black currant and a floral is just like yeah it's a sweet floral They're different, but very super similar. Y'all, it's not a dupe, but these are gonna pair well together. I'm just gonna say that. This one's sweeter. This one's way sweeter because now I'm getting that caramel. And this one is powdery. They're different, but very, very similar. I think they would layer well together, honestly. And this is the, um, yeah, these two. Dang. Yeah, this one doesn't stay sweet. The black currant kind of just mills all the way down. And then it becomes like a floral powdery scent. And this one, the black currant, it, it mobs down, but you're left with like a floral, caramel, sweet scent. This is good. This, is, this smells really good. I wonder what the wear time is like on this. Let's see how it layers with coconut. Fresh coconut. I'm gonna be smelling this all day. Well, let's move on. <laughs> Let's do, let's do, I ordered some stuff from, um, my coworker, she does paparazzi, and I just wanted to support her, so I, ordered, I made an order of some things, I don't even honestly remember everything that I bought, but let's just see if I can remember, and y'all know paparazzi, they do like the little, like, you know, a little bit jewelry, necklace sets and things. But I love to gather things like this for Christmas. Oh, this is pretty. I remember getting this. Look at that. That's so nice. It's like a long necklace and it's got these cute little earrings on there that somebody can wear like on a top. I used to love, like when I used to work at the bank, well, I work at the bank, but like when I used to work in the branch physically, I used to love to wear little necklaces like this. Um, you know, with my tops. I got this one too. I like the earrings on this one. They were like really simple, like dangly earrings. And then it matches the little dangles on here. I thought these would be cute um, to give to people for Christmas. I'm slowly but surely gathering things to like, you know, divide up i never really the only people who i kind of um consciously like plan semi-plan is my mom and my mother-in-law i try to see what they need or see what i want them to have you know but um like for my cousins and like sister-in-laws like i just kind of just grab things and see what i got that fits them at the end and make it work with the stuff that I have on hand. And now I can't get this stuff up in here. Maybe if I go this way. You know what? We're gonna fool with that later. And then I ordered, oh yeah, this, this little necklace. I thought this was cute. I was thinking about keeping this for myself. I don't really like the earrings, but I thought the necklace was cute, like grunge, like bronzy looking. And then she had this like adjustable ring. Can y'all see it? Isn't that pretty? Like costume ring. I have bat fingers. But I thought that was cute. <laughs> oh, she gave me some earrings for free. She said goes with the necklace. Well, which necklace? Oh. Well, which next? This one? Oh, I gotta text her. I guess they go with this one. 
Cause I think that's the same like kind of look. That's pretty. That's a nice little gift set. Those earrings are cute. And then I asked her if she had some hoops. I already know who I'm gonna get these to. Cause these are too big for me personally, but they're pretty. Ain't they cute? Like all this was like $5 a piece. Um, I think the sets might have been more. I don't know, all of it was like $30, so. But these are pretty. I'm gonna give these to, I know exactly who. So I got all that. I'm trying to keep moving so that I can clean up and all that. Now with the Victoria's Secret. And Alex got me the new um, perfume, which is the Coco Soray. I need to make a shorts unboxing this. And then I think I gotta come back to y'all. Content creation is just, <laughs> cause I wanna show y'all the bottle and everything, but I need to, I wanted to do an unboxing. I'll be right back y'all. So I did the unboxing. I did try to talk Not too far away. I don't think y'all this far away. I did try to do a talking one, but if Ivy is as loud as I think she is, it didn't happen. But anyways, okay. This is the Tease Flanker in the scent Coco Soray. And this has Lush Wild Berry, Freesia Petals, Whipped Mocha. That's it. They love Freesia now that I'm thinking about it. This one smells really good too. It's more, but it's not what you think. It's not like a super, I think I sprayed. Y'all, I done sprayed everything. I done sprayed everything. Mm-hmm. This is a berry, a berry scent in the opening and then the dry down. It's like a creamy floral with a hint of cocoa. Like a hint. It's still very much teas. Like if you think of like the original teas, like that pear, fresh pear, uh, vanilla, and I think freesia. This one is, it's the same vibe. It's just a little different. Like I said, it's got that hint of cocoa. So I got the 3.4 ounce and I got the cute little bag, little puffer bag. All these are all the rage right now. It's pretty roomy in there. Um, it'll be cute to like put things in. The fragrance fits pretty good in there. Like, I put all these fragrances in there. And then let's put this box in there so I can show y'all how much it can fit. Something's too tall. Oh, there you go. See, it holds quite a bit. So I put all those fragrances in there. So, it's a pretty roomy bag. You can use it as a clutch or like a travel bag, you know, whatever you wanna do. I just thought it was really cute in this chocolate color, just a vibe. And then, so I did the bundle with the 3.4 ounce. So I got a lotion and a mist as well. And I just went for the Tease Cream Cloud because I don't have any of these. I don't have the perfume for this one and I haven't got a chance to smell it. I really just wanted the lotion, but since I had the coupon, I was like, let me just get the 3.4 in the mix because I want to use this lotion with, um, are the notes not on here? All this and no notes. Okay, let's look it up. <laughs> I try to be on top of it. Tees. Cream Cloud is the first one. I wanted to use this one, I think, with Ivory Cashmere from Bath and Body Works. So I thought they would go well together, the lotion at least. Um, meringue are the top notes, vanilla. Middle notes are sandalwood flower, and the base notes are musk and amber. So it's got that warm, clean feel, like ivory cashmere. But it's, it's sweeter. 
lightly sweeter. Ivory cashmere gives me like a clean feel. And this is a little bit, it's a clean feel, but it's, um, it's sweeter. So I think um, all three of these will lay well together in the winter. Um, I'm already thinking about my winter <laughs> body care, <laughs> but I want to wear this with my autumn shore, like that coffee um, vanilla scent. I think this will go really good with that. So I plan to use that with that. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna use it regardless, but that's what I plan to use it with. And now let's talk Bath and Body Works. Oh, and I got um, a Candy Baby lip gloss so that I can use my coupon because um, the bundle was 95 and the coupon I had was 30 off 100 and it had to be pre-tax. So I need to five more dollars. So I got a lip gloss. Put that in the Christmas pile too. And then for Bath and Body Works, I went ahead and picked up the Vampire Blood um, shower gel to go with. This is so pretty. Does this not remind you of the Vampire Diaries? I love the Vampire Diaries. I still watch it at my big age. Um, so I got that with my free reward. Um, it's $13.50. The notes in this one is red berries, night blooming, jasmine, and petrifying plum. Petrifying plum. Um, so I have the fragrance mist. I didn't get the lotion because if my dream, heavenly dream angel, if the pink one by Victoria's Secret, if that body cream lasts through this, this set that I have using right now, I would put it with that. If not, I'm gonna have to find a lotion that I wanna pair this with. So, I don't know. Now I'm thinking that I could have did the Coco Soray body lotion with this. Cause wouldn't that be cute? Like, wouldn't that be nice? Like the red berries and the jasmine. I don't know, whatever, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out later. Um, I had a deal where I could get a wallflower plug and a free plug-in to go with it. So I just got sweet whiskey and a basic wallflower. I'm probably gonna put this in the living room. I had a free travel size body care item. So I got the pumpkin pecan waffles. I like this better than pumpkin latte. It smells like syrup, like syrup and cinnamon and pumpkin type stuff. And then I bought three candles because they were $13.95 and they did the members appreciation week or whatever. They gave us like $10 off of 30. So I have a uh, backup of coffee and whiskey because y'all know that's my favorite. I like coffee and whiskey and I like sweet whiskey. But I got another coffee and whiskey. And then I got some fall scents because I'm getting in the mood now that I've been looking at pumpkins for two weeks. I think that I'm ready for, I'll be ready once these candles that I'm using burn down because my kitchen candle is almost gone. I got the white, can y'all see it? What is it called? White pumpkin oak wood. This is pumpkin, sandalwood, and spice. This smells so good. It's like a, it smells like a ice, a pumpkin cream ice chai tea latte that I had this morning. It smells like that in a cup. It smells in a candle. It smells so good. And then last, I picked up, I think another pumpkin scent. Oh yeah, I got another pumpkin scent for the kitchen, uh, apple pumpkin or pumpkin apple. This smells good. It's it's a nice take. I like it. It's red delicious apple, fall pumpkin, fresh ground cinnamon, clove buds. It smells good. It's like the opening is like a fresh apple and then the cinnamon and stuff comes in. So I thought that'd be good to replace because in the kitchen right now I'm burning honey crisp apple. And this is a true, a true clean apple scent. I love this and like it's halfway gone if you can see so I just wanted to go ahead and get my kitchen scent picked out um this is gonna be a living room burner 
And coffee and whiskey, I'm just gonna put in my cabinet for later, probably for like my bedroom or something, because it's my favorite. Right now in my bedroom, I have sweet whiskey. So, this is all the stuff I bought, y'all. Happy Sunday. So, I just wanted to show you guys my outfit. I paired the skirt that I got last weekend at Versona. So, the skirt is by Versona um, with this tank that I've had for a really long time from uh, JCPenney, the Worthington brand. They just make good clothes. And I love the detail on this. I've had this for years. And then I just put on my Versona necklace stack and my little Amazon earrings my forever mood headband it's like a light pink color y'all know the scrunchies are from amazon so yeah and then i just have on my um toy birch white sandals and yeah i don't know if you guys i don't have the lighting skill but this is my makeup i did just like a tinted moisturizer um it's very creamy it's a creamy type of face the only powder i used was to set my concealer and i used the hourglass palette and i just love this lip plumper like this just makes my lips look so pretty like i love how heavy my top lip looks i don't know i'm just a fan um and then the scents that i used today were the fresh coconut and cotton and i also layer in the new so de janeiro um after hours they just like Fresh coconut and cotton is just like really fresh and light and sweet. And then I feel like the um, Rio, the Sol de Janeiro just adds like a a sexiness. Like it is an after hours, like if you go out, but I don't go out, so I go to church. So it's an elevated type of perfume. I feel like it's deeper, it's sweet, so, but it's floral. I feel like it's wearable to church. And um, yeah, I gotta get the kids ready. Um, Ivy's still asleep and the kids are getting dressed, the girls are getting dressed, and so I'm gonna go do their hair, wake up Ivy, get her dressed, and we're gonna go. y'all we are home from church and lunch and a, well lunch we had lunch at this like arcade um took the kids so real quick we're gonna do possibly gonna empty the oxy sanitizer you know i love this stuff to sanitize my laundry, I emptied the Clorox Sentiva in the scent Tuscan Lavender and Jasmine. I also emptied, again, Ultra Easy Squeeze dish detergent. And I also emptied the Power Blast. Um, you know, kind of like the Dawn spray on stuff. I emptied one of these. And you just buy the refills. 
from Walmart. And then for laundry, I also emptied the Gain fabric softener in Spring Daydream. This smells so good. I'm going to buy another one. Also emptied my Gain original scent laundry detergent. And I also emptied my Downy April Fresh fabric softener. I thought I emptied some scent boosters. Let me see if I've got another bag. Yeah, I'm here. I'm gonna empty something else. Maybe not. I don't know. But apparently I emptied another easy squeeze, so I emptied two of these. And those are my household empties. All right, y'all. I'm gonna let y'all go. Hope y'all enjoyed hanging out with me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys this Thursday. I think I'm going to do like a Amazon favorites, like vlog style. I'll show you some different things that I got from Amazon. So I think that'll be fun. And yeah, I'm about to down a coffee because I have so much to do. Like my laundry room is a wreck. So I'm about to get started. Get started. So, see you guys this Thursday. Bye.